This is weird for me, because usually I start these things by driving, and I'm starting it by parking. We're at Goodwill. Can you see it? It's right over there. Hold on, there we go. There. Um, so like I mentioned last week, in this video this week, um, I'm going to be looking for specific things at Goodwill. I asked you in the comments below last week to name some things that you want me to try to find. So I was given three things, and if I'm not feeling lazy, I'm going to put a graphic over right here. So I'm looking for a clown that's more than a foot tall, okay, anything zebra print, which I don't think should be actually that hard, and finally... I'm looking for a popcorn popper, an old style popcorn popper. Now, I don't know specifically if that means like one of the surface ones, you know, the one that looks like a big hot plate with a cover, or one of the um, like hot air poppers that like comes out of the popcorn spout, popcorn spout. So yeah, that's what we're looking for. And uh, when we go inside Goodwill, I'm probably going to play with this footage a bit and throw some effects on and like have fun because... I mean, what's better than, you know, effects for almost no reason? Because when you add effects to a video, it should add something. You shouldn't just add effects because you can. Hmm. Let's go. I should have said let's go slower so I could give myself time to take my hand out of the shot. But... I suck. All right, here we are heading in sale on pottery oh here's our first item zebra print got it that was that was an easy one i wasn't expecting that one to be too hard here we are electronics get a vcr rewinder slash fast forwarder that's uh it's more uncommon usually when you see the rewinder you know dsl modem i don't know why that got my attention Ooh, war that's that shouldn't be here some bits and bobs. Oh, this um, sharp speaker got my attention for some reason. Not sure why. Maybe because it looked better than most things that's over here. Who knows? Who knows? Yeah. That big wooden clock still here. That's been there for a while. Uh, your standard run-of-the-mill piles of VCRs. I get a RF modulator. You just need to, like, modulate and whatnot, you know. Wow, big ass karaoke boombox, so fun. Some puzzles, oh my god, get get out of there. Oh, what's this, what's this, what's this, what's this? It's our clown, over a foot tall, crazy. Knickknacks, 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 knickknacks. Do you need some knickknacks? All right, so we're looking for the popcorn popper. So we're looking around, got some appliances, some more appliances, there's always like funny George Foreman grills, they never give me that as a challenge. And then, uh, yeah, what, 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 this is, no, yeah, never buy a tripod at Goodwill, it's always missing the shoe, so you can never actually put anything on it. And one of those all in one home speakers. What is this? What is this thing? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Where are you going? Where? Okay. Who is the real fisherman? No one knows. Then uh, I think I saw this and I thought this was sad. Because it says, um, Great Grammy's cup holder. Oh. Great Grammy. Mm. Oh well. You take care wooden things. Who buys wooden things? Melee. Kills campers dead. Ooh, yeah. Exciting. They actually had more anime DVDs than I've seen here in quite a while. They had a whole little four of them, which is a lot. Then, uh, just checking out some kids' books. You know, little children's reading. And David Sedaris. So that's... I always look at the tech section. Got a Primal Rage. It's not bad. But other than that, 
Kind of dead. Spyro, I'll take Spyro. Give me that. Oh, she's the man. Love it. Love it. Oh, more zebra print. That's like two. Oh, well done. Digital cameras. Can't give away a digital camera anymore. Oh, well. <coughs> All right. Maybe we'll just record the drive. We'll do a little driving. Let's do a little driving. So... I might have said leopard print in the beginning. Did I say leopard print? I don't know. Correct me in the subtitle. Future editing Josh. Correct me in the subtitle. So we're looking for zebra print, a clown that was over a foot tall, and an old school popcorn popper. We went two out of three. Two out of three. We found the clown, big ass scary clown statue. We found a couple of things that were zebra print and no popcorn popper. And then we saw some depressing things like the cop copy of Spiral the Dragon with She's the Man inside. God, that's... I mean, it was $20, so I wasn't going to buy it anyway, but it's just a bummer, you know? That someone would just steal it. That bums me out. It bums me out. You know? Other people just steal shit. <coughs> it's not a vlog if I don't cough a little bit in it. Wow, the whole road just opened up to me. This is nice. So we're gonna go to our other, our other second Goodwill. My mind is way ahead of my body there. My body was ahead of my mind. Whatever. Yeah, we're going to go to our second Goodwill. In the wrong lane. Yeah. Try to find that popcorn popper. That was the third item. Robert sent me that one via private message. Private. Private message. So, apparently that was the good one. That was the one to try to find. I thought the clown was going to be hard, but we found a pretty big clown right away. So, yeah. So we're going to go to our other Goodwill, which is like six or seven minutes away. And will we leave all this in? I don't know. I don't know. Safely. Safety first. Let's let's go up a little bit. There we go. Welcome back. So yeah. I also I didn't I don't think I showed you, but I bought a um, a shadow box thing at Goodwill. Because I have this stuff for my uh, best friend's wedding that I'm meeting the shadow box for like ever. Yeah, does that make me sound old? Like I got this stuff, the shadow box what it's come to in my life, doing a little shadow boxing, is this really, I think we can kill one window, I can't kill all the windows though, it's too hot, it's a scorcher here in coastal Maine, mid coast Maine, of course a scorcher here means like what, I don't know, it's probably like 75 today. But it feels hot to me, okay? If you're from, like, Guam or something, and you're laughing, you're justified. But to me, it's hot, okay? It's hot. I don't like it. Just... No. So, yeah. Popcorn popper. I remember being a kid and having one of these, like, hot air popcorn poppers always always a good time. They still make popcorn really well. Like if I had a preference, it would still be like one of these hot air popcorn poppers. I never had any um, experience with like the surface like disc like hot plate ones, so I can't 
I cannot attest to how those work, but the hot air ones were my shit as a kid. I also thought um, Jiffy Pop was always really cool. Like, anyone ever do Jiffy Pop? You know, it's the popcorn that comes in like the aluminum, aluminum, aluminum pan, foil, dish, and you stick it on the stove and it pops, that was an awful popping sound, anyway, yeah, so, some people like that, I think we had, like, Jiffy Pop once or twice, as a kid, I thought it was, like, the coolest thing ever, like, popcorn on the stove, are you kidding me, man, technology, so, I feel like it also always made me feel like I was at, like, a campfire, you know, the Jiffy Pop, like, you know, you gathered around a campfire and enjoying some Jiffy Pop. You know, someone's someone's gutting a trout. Those are the kind of things that happen at campfire. There's a bear hanging out. Just a big old bear just waiting on some Jiffy Pop. Of course, a bear wouldn't wait on Jiffy Pop. He'd just tear your camp to shreds looking for any morsel of food or lotion. They're attracted to all those smells. Um, so be careful when it comes to bears. It's important stuff. Anyway, bears aside. Yeah, yeah that's it, bears aside. I haven't actually been to this Goodwill in like a month or two. Because usually I just go to the one that's like in town. And then I um, call it a day. But since I've got a goal and purpose and my life has meaning, I'm going to try to find this popcorn hot air popper. I think I'm going to apply the um, cheesy camera recording effect over all my Goodwill footage from now on. So let me know if you like that or not, because I like doing stuff like that, like, you know, adding effects for no reason. I don't know, I just felt like the footage inside of Goodwill needed, like, something to just differentiate it from, like, this footage, where I'm, like, talking to you guys for no reason. You can shift, I suppose. Shifting is important. Of course, now the speed limit drops, like, 10 miles per hour, so it makes no sense. I'm a good driver. driver. I always thought to myself what would happen if like, I got into an accident while this was rolling. Would that be like the best video ever? And it could get millions of hits because I just hang it. It's like fat guy vlog, car accident. People would love it. People would love it. And it'd get so many millions of views I could pay for a new car. Mm. That would be good. No, it wouldn't. I'd probably be dead. That would be bad. Death is bad. Just say no to death. Never taught that us, that us in DARE. Anyone else go to DARE? Any other DARE graduates out there? DARE, drug abuse resistance education. Was that it? Drug abuse resistance education, I think. I think that was it. Maybe I've taken too many drugs to remember. Uh, who knows? McGruff the Crime Dog? I feel like they were always in bed together. Dare and McGruff the Crime Dog. A lot of times you see them together because, you know, you'd have McGruff and he'd be like in his weird ass trench coat even though he's a dog. And then they'd just be like spitting some hot shit about not doing drugs. Yep. That's, that's McGruff for you. Spitting, spitting shit about not doing drugs. I feel like you don't see McGruff the crime dog anymore. I feel like you don't see McGruff the crime dog and Smokey the Bear. Like, where are they at? I feel like they must be together. Like, chilling. Like, maybe smoking a joint in the woods. Which would really be the antithesis of both their characters. Mmm, that's good. That is good. 
<sighs> what else is going on? I don't know. I felt like a long week at work. Even though it probably wasn't. But sometimes it feels long. The mail. The mail is the mail. It just keeps coming. It just keeps coming. Granted, I'd say a good... I don't know. 60% of the mail. 60%? Yeah, it's just junk at this point. There's like 40% of the mail, which is like... If they take that 40%, I'd say about 25% is bills. And that last 15% is actually like people talking to other people. And the people that are talking to other people, it's either like... Holiday-themed cards. Mother's Day, Father's Day, Christmas, Thanksgiving. Flag Day. You know, whatever you celebrate. And then like, you know, letters from Grandma. That's about it. Because... Grandmas are basically the only ones still sending letters. So. It is what it is. Still do way more business than UPS and FedEx. So. Yeah. Whatever, dog. Whatever. Should I go into my local game store? I've been in there for a while. Funny story about my local game store. For whatever reason, the guy who owns the game store, I follow his wife on Instagram. Not sure how that happened, but I follow his wife on Instagram. So sometimes I see him pop up on my Instagram because she'll take pictures with him and stuff. So it's kind of weird. But I don't even remember how how that happened. I was bumping. I had to take a minute. Listen. Um, that and he was like right next to me. I didn't feel like talking. But he was bumping. Now I'm probably going to get a copyright claim for that 10 seconds of song. Oh well. Go ahead and claim it. Go ahead. I don't do this for money, obviously. Actually, it just costs me money. That's one of the big secrets of YouTube that people don't seem to like grasp is that YouTube costs money. Like, I'm out spending my own money on gas, driving around, making videos for very tiny, tiny market. Tiny. That is not going to earn me any any revenue whatsoever. So you really got to make videos because you want to make videos. And that's why I do it. So I like making videos. So. Ooh, I didn't even check. What's the sale color? Sale color red. 2,500 new items daily. Yeah, well, 2,500 new items and 2,400 of them are closed. So, not fooling me, Goodwill. Not fooling me. I should say 2,400 new clothes items. And a child in the way. Okay. God, that's why I was so hard even in the sunroof open. God, I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. All right, let's see. What a sweet bike. I would have killed it one of these as a kid. Now I guess I just drive. So here's the electronics. It took me like 10 minutes to record here because there was a guy just like luring around. So a lot of VCRs. First one was kind of a high-end VCR, if you want to call it that. Then we got, uh, oh god, remember when cell phones took cords like this? Focus, it's not going to focus, I remember this. Oh well, it's fine. Oh, hip-hop tattoos! Sign me up, dog. Yo, yo, yo. Let's see, uh, we're looking for popcorn popper. Popcorn popper. Popcorn popper. No, I guess not. Well... This would be an unsuccessful hunt. Unsuccessful. Wait, 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 wait. Pop light, pop car, hot air popper. There we go. Got it. Almost missed it. Almost missed it. Mouse trap. So, who wants to bet money? All the pieces are here. Huh? I'll take that bet. No way. What do we got? 
Oh, God. Remember those Burry King games they gave away, basically? There was this one, there was Sneak King, and there was another one. I had Sneak King. That one was kind of funny. Oh, hilarious. Ooh, Ken Burns Civil War. If you ever get a chance, check this out. It's probably the best Civil War documentary. Oh, the Nets. In motion. Good times. Good times. What is this statue? What is, this? is this the award for winning? Finding all the items? Thank you. Scrapbooking. Scrapbooking supplies. I'm so old. I think about scrapbooking. Ooh, do you need a cover for your Nokia? Just in case. Here's the model number. 252. If you got a Nokia 252, let me know. What? What? What is going on here? What is going on here? Gotta say, first week of Goodwill Challenge in the bag. Found that popcorn popper. I almost didn't see it. Um, it's funny, like when you're looking through the camera to look at things, you look at things through the camera, through the phone. So you don't necessarily actually like see what you're looking at, if that makes any sense. You're more concerned about capturing information through the lens. So like I had to like stop and stop filming and look again and there it was just sitting on the bottom shelf so challenge complete zebra print one foot tall clown and hot air popcorn popper old school popcorn popper I don't know I guess you're just gonna have to step it up next week see if you can do a little better um I think I'm gonna go into my local game store do I have time just stop it real quick. I'll go into my local game store and see what they've got. I've never recorded in there because I don't know if uh, the guy would be cool with it. It's good. Then again, I've never asked him either, so I don't, I don't know. He'd probably be fine. But anyway, we'll go see what's happening in there. I know on Instagram they're posting the other day about how they sell pops now, or they've always had pops and now they're just pushing the pops. I don't know. I don't know. Remains to be seen. But anyway, yeah, we'll go in there. Well, I'll go in there. I don't know if you're going to go in there, audience. But yeah. So, what I'm going to say is, for next week, you're going to have to come up with some new challenges for, um, for Goodwill. Because those ones are a little bit too easy. I mean, they weren't too easy. Like, the popcorn popper was a challenge. I had to go to both Goodwills to find that. And, like, I suppose if I really had to step it up, I'd go to both Goodwills and then even hit up, like, um, the Salvation Army. I've never been to our Salvation Army kind of in town, which is funny because you think that would just be, like, on my list of stops, but it's not. It's the first space open. It's the first space open. Oh, my God. First space. Don't hit the card though. Oh yeah. First space. It's like in the movies. Alright. Let's go and maybe see what's happening in here. Maybe it won't. Maybe this will be it. I don't know. So we didn't uh, record in the game store. I had a little chat with uh, Tony in there. We talked about games and we had a laugh about that um, Spyro over at Goodwill with the friggin' movie inside. So ridiculous. Anyway, I'm gonna go into game, 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 game. Best Buy and uh, I don't know, maybe look for Jasmine. No, oh my God, they're so loud over there. Anyway. Look at this. Oh, they can go down to 40 bucks. Not bad. Let's see, they got all of the new Kirby Amiibos, so I'm not going to be in a rush. They've still got a lot of Shovel Knights. I don't see Shovel Knight basically anywhere else. And they got their kind of overflow. Still got a Ryu. They still got Fox. They still got Dark Pit. Oh, Finding Dory set. I wanted this. I don't know. 
Any Jasmine? No. Alice? I want Alice at some point. Ugh. Gotta do this quick. All the windows are sealed up and it's about 9,000 degrees. So yeah, we ended up buying the Finding Dory playset at Best Buy. We might return it. Who knows? Um, what else? We found all three items for our Goodwill hunt. So that was good. We found Zebra Print, Big Clown, and a Popcorn Popper. So next week, you know, if you want to suggest some more items for me to try to find, let me know. I keep looking over there for some reason. I'm not sure why. Let me know. Put it in the comments down below, and uh, we'll check those out. Tomorrow, for sure, for sure, I'm going to do my uh, Mystery Pop unboxing. I know I talked about that last week, but it didn't happen because, you know, I have a life. It's true, I do. Really. So anyway, thanks for watching. Make sure to comment, subscribe below. Um, let me know about things to find, because I like finding things. Because otherwise I'm just wandering around making commentary for, uh, for, yeah. So, okay. We'll see you next time. I don't know what that was. I just, I should stop.